this short film, we are sharing our recent experiences in managing a specific type of a keratopathy in a series of our farmer patients which is typically seen after spraying of insecticides this is a typical presentation the patient usually presents as an emergency with severe pain and photophobia he is unable to open his eyes A drop of local anesthetic brings in significant relief for him and this is also the only way we can examine him. Slit lap examination revealed multiple corneal erosions which were very extensive and covering the entire cornea. There were areas which appear as having these epithelial blisters or cystic epithelial swelling which are clearly seen in retroillumination mode. These extensive epithelial erosions explain the severity of the symptoms. Majority of the patients had these extensive epithelial defects sometimes extending throughout the cornea. The culprit for this problem in our series of 20 patients has been this insecticide called as the diphenthuron. Each one of our patient had used the same ingredient. Typically it's in a powder form which is mixed in water and sprayed on to the plants. There is no history of the insecticide having fallen into the eye. but the fumes themselves were severely toxic enough to the cornea and the symptoms usually started several hours after the spraying typically the healing is delayed and takes couple of weeks for the epithelium to regrow the treatment is aimed at facilitating faster healing and growth of the epithelium by using frequent lubricating eye drops gels and occasionally bandage contact lenses Although it takes a long time most of them eventually do well over a period of time we have seen 20 cases this month alone all of them were cotton farmers and were using the same insecticide diphenthuron